The current status of Christians and other non-Muslim minorities throughout the Middle East is the worst it's been in centuries. 21 people were killed when a powerful bomb exploded in front of a Coptic Christian church. Muslim mobs began attacking Christian churches. And they are targeting churches, temples, cultural and historical sites. I converted from Islam to Christianity. I was arrested and after that they gave me a death penalty. What I told the judge in this day, if loving and worshipping Christ is a crime, I am guilty as charged. The Christians of Iraq and Syria who fled ISIS narrowly escaped a genocidal campaign of mass murder, of crucifixions, and of beheadings. Now we are here in Inkawa Center for youth. Uh, we have here uh, 186 caravan, 260 families here. What is taking place in the Middle East, particularly in Iraq, is genocide. They call this ethnic cleansing. This is the real world. The administration failing, the Congress is failing, and quite frankly, with all due respect, the church is failing. In response to persecution, I always want to tell people to pray. Stop, pray, be burdened for your brother and sister, but get involved in the fight and help. And it doesn't matter how small is your voice, you can make a difference, even if you are just one person.